Hey guys, I am doing a review on the L'Oreal True Match Lumi Healthy Luminous Makeup <laughs> and that is a mouthful. Um, this has an SPF of 20. This was requested by someone I know. There's like a million videos on this because this foundation came out quite a bit. Um, it's no longer that new. But um, anyways, someone requested it and I'm going to do it for them. So um, my color is W4 Warm Natural Beige right there and this has um, yellow undertones to it most of the foundations that I buy just to let you guys know are either yellow undertones or um, neutral undertones I never buy pink undertones because it would just not mm -mm, it just does not go with my skin but um, those are my undertones the ones that go work well with my skin tone um, so I just thought I'd throw that out there um, anyways this foundation is awesome. It comes with a pump. They have so many colors to select from. Um, it just gives a really dewy, natural finish. I am going to do a demo really quick. Um, insert a demo in here as well. And um, I have to say, it's one of my favorite dewy drugstore foundations. Um, it's the only like luminous foundation that I own. Everything else is matte or satin kind of finish. I have oily combo skin, so I'm always hesitant about using a luminous or um, dewy foundation. But this one really is good, even if you have combo to oily skin. It's a drugstore version, and I feel like it just makes you look healthy and glowy. I actually have, it's what I have on my face right now, and it doesn't look over exaggerately dewy like you just got out of the shower or anything like that. And it doesn't, um, look glittery either where you look like a disco ball so definitely give it a try there's so many colors to pick from and I have to say I'm super impressed with this um, I don't know what else to say about it it's just super awesome if you are hesitant and you have combo to oily skin check this out um, it is not long wearing that is the one um, flaw to it but I mean, it does give a natural, like, luminosity to your skin. So, I would say if you're going to use this for around maybe four to five hours, it's going to look okay. Maybe on your sixth hour, I see that when I wear this to work, it starts fading. Like, um, Sammy from Sammy's Makeup Corner. I think it's Sammy's Makeup Corner. Yeah. She was like, she wrote on one of my videos, she's like, what the hell happens to foundation that it, like, poof, disappears? And I have no idea. Like, that really freaky um, but yeah it just rubs off fades sweats away etc so that's the sucky part to it but other than that um, really really check this out I really love it um, just evens out your skin tone medium coverage and I think I'm repeating myself I think I say this in the other part so um, just keep watching if you want to see the demo and my overall impressions on it Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and use the um, L'Oreal True Match. And I'm going to use my buffing brush from Real Techniques. And I just put two pumps on there because this doesn't pump out a lot of products, so that's why I have two. And I have absolutely nothing, no primer, nothing on my face. I'm just going to put this directly on my face. I do suggest using a primer with this when you use it because... It's not really long lasting. It does look really nice and natural on the skin, but it's not a long lasting foundation. Okay, so that is two pumps. And um, I don't know if you guys can tell, it's kind of like a medium coverage. But even here, I have a little acne mark, a little scar and you see it didn't cover it up and those were two pumps so obviously with this kind of foundation it's very light it's more to even out your skin tone and cover small flaws it wouldn't I don't think it would cover like if you had a lot of um, scars or acne you'd have to put maybe a concealer or really like pile it on with a few pumps to be able to cover that so as you can see it's very natural looking I absolutely love the way this look it looks so healthy and glowy without any kind of shimmers at all. It's one of my favorite um, dewy foundations or glowy foundations from the drugstore. Um, 
which is really funny because I used to think because I have combo oily skin that this wouldn't work for me. And this really does a nice job on my skin. I feel like it doesn't um, make it oilier or it doesn't um, not last on my skin. So I'm going to finish up and then show you the overall um, face. Okay, so this is the finished look. I am wearing some bright lipstick today. This is one of the new Vivids and um, Pink Pop. But I just put some powder, my Neutrogena Healthy Skin Powder, over it. And it looks so natural. I absolutely love this foundation just because how natural it looks. And it kind of like gives some luminosity to the face but without like over-exaggerating it and having 10,000 glitter shimmers all over your face. So I don't know how they do it but... Seriously, this is just like an awesome foundation. Like I said, it's not long wearing at all, so that's the only bad thing. But other than that, I absolutely love it. They have so many shades, and this one like just blends in seamlessly. So, yeah, that's my review on it, and hopefully this was helpful to um, the person who requested it. And thank you guys so much for subscribing and watching, and take care. Bye.